This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Paris Saint-Germain taking on Chelsea. Well, Derek, this is magnificent. The atmosphere inside this stadium is electric. Let's just hope the tension doesn't affect the players. It shouldn't do. Just look at the quality down there. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Gianluigi Donnarumma stands between the posts. Marquinhos plays with Sergio Ramos at the back. Lionel Messi starts with Neymar in the wide positions. And handed the task of playing up front today is Kylian Mbappe. Here's the lineup for Chelsea. Edouard Mendy stands between the posts. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Thiago Silva in central defence. Jorginho plays with N'Goro Conte in the centre of the park. And the main threat in attack today will likely be Romelu Lukaku. And now the Champions League final commences. He's going forward well here. And let's give credit to the defending. Mbappe. Aspili Quetta. An exciting talent who has everything a forward needs to be successful. Stuart, what are you expecting to see from Mbappe? Well, Derek, he's a great all-round player, but it's his ability to run in behind defenders that makes him such a threat. And when he gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, he usually scores. N'Golo Conte. Lukaku. What can Chelsea do from this position? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Messi. Verratti now, Idrissa Gay, Neymar, extremely sloppy in possession. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. Rudiger. Marcos Alonso. This is Thiago Silva. Mount. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Neymar. And now Gay. Space and time for the cross. Can he give them the advantage? And he's outdone himself. Wonderful save there. Jorginho. A really intense pressure applied. Lionel Messi. And return to Mbappe. Really good challenge. Jorginho Conte 
Attacking possibilities for Chelsea. Lukaku. This looks promising. Now Conte has the strength to hang on to it. Lukaku. He can't hold on to it. And a corner coming up for Chelsea. Can they make good use of it? Let's see about the delivery. Well, the clearance, half-hearted. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Hakimi. Well, there you have it. In terms of possession, there's not much in it. It really has been a hard-fought battle so far. One of these teams needs to start taking a risk or two. Christensen. Now with Jorginho. It's with Marcos Alonso. Keeping the ball moving. Well, visionary passing. Just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Mbappe. Idrissa Gay. Mbappe with it. Ronaldo. Well, disappointing end to the move. That is that for the first half here. And now the Champions League final commences. Has the strength to hang on to it. He can't hold on to it. And a corner coming up for Chelsea. Can they make good use of it? Forty-five minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Marcos Alonso. Conte has it. Mount. Jorginho. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Idrissa Gay, Mbappe, PSG looking dangerous, but they took care of the situation defensively. Conte, here's Mount, well no stopping him, Lukaku, ball's gone. Verratti Neymar and space for the cross effective challenge they've regained possession and so 30 minutes left for play in this one Messi and a goal Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. Well, the ball is 
moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Marcos Alonso. Well, as the stats confirm, Chelsea have controlled the ball, but their attacking play has been too slow, mainly due to a lack of movement of the front players. At some point, they have to threaten the space in behind the defenders, otherwise they're going to lose this. Patient enough build-up. Can they carve out a chance? Lukaku. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Neymar. And PSG pushing forward with options available. Gay. Oh, great block. Corner kick awarded. And let's see if this will help them add to their lead. Substitution it is for PSG. Number 27, Idrissa Gouaille, coming onto the pitch. Number 15, Daniel Playing it in. Well, here you can see it again. It's a superb cross, just asking for someone to go and meet it, which makes it a fairly simple finish in the end. It's a really good goal. Well, a second goal for them here. Quarter of an hour remaining here. Now Chelsea in a position of menace. Pulisic. Well, can they prize them open now? Conte. Now with Jorginho. And he read it well. Mbappe, PSG couldn't keep it. N'Golo Conte. Possession lost by Chelsea here. Neymar. And space to attack. Has someone to play it to? Well, the keeper wasn't worried in the slightest. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Well, in the closing phase here, and PSG excelling, Stuart. Well, they've controlled most of the game, haven't they? Their one and two touch passing has been sharp, the movement's been bright, and they've scored some good goals. They just need to keep their concentration through to the final whistle. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Mbappe. Di Maria pulls it back. And a no-nonsense clearance. Full time! Parisian pride shines through. PSG have cleared the final hurdle in the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night.
for these players well it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond well they have to make the most of this don't they it's a great feat what an achievement from them well they don't need to be reminded about what comes next it's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy well there's some tired players out there but what you can be sure of they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy they'll be going mad in the next few moments the Champions League winners Paris Saint-Germain well this is what they wanted what a moment for these players they've worked so hard to win this trophy they've been fantastic and you can feel the emotion it's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.